Hello, y'all. This is Ari Kitten Crescentman, whatever the hell you want to call me. Um, uh, I wanted to do a um, yarn tail update. Cat's attacking me. Um, because now that I have my screen, the last time I did a yarn tail thing, um, I didn't actually have my camera working. So thanks to Jacob like Wolf, I got it working. So yarn tail update again. Go to uh, um, find my other video. I'll put it in an annotation. Probably knowing my luck up that way somewhere in a corner somewhere on the screen so click it i'll take you to my other video which will give you a link to zoala who um is the one who does the tutorial for these things i'm not going to do a tutorial i'm not taking that from her it's not going to happen but i will update you and show you how i've done it now my cat's probably going to attack me now as she's going to show you there's a way to do the braid and whatnot so so far this is how i've done it the tip of the tail isn't quite done yet um the only tip that I've done that she I don't, she uses a hair iron, I use the ironing, like an actual ironing board. But that's how the tip's done so far. My cat's going to try to attack it here. Anyway. No. Um, just to show you the little fluffs. Now, I tried doing the longer fluffs, about measuring from about, um, I would say, the tip of my finger to about the tip of my elbow. Didn't work. They ended up fluffing out to this and I almost lost a lot of yarn so just basically six, at least six inches worth of fluff and then you just brush them out with a pet brush that's what I did I was going to make a few and actually brush it out on cam but take a wire pet brush this oof, this thing right here yes oof. this thing right here okay this is what my kid my roommate got me for Christmas so I could do these Okay, so this little wire hair brush right here, this thing's actually pretty cool. You can do this and it takes the fuzz right off by pushing this button. Like that, and my cat loves it. I brush her while I'm making my yarn tails. It keeps her out of my yarn. Um, so if you have cats at home, just, you know, give them a quick brush and they should leave things alone. They absolutely love it. And, you know, spend some time with your fur babies while you make your fur tail. We are all fur after all. So... Anywho, that's what I use, is this brush right here. Um, yeah, she loves this thing. Absolutely adores it. You know, she's eight months old. Anyway, um, the fur tufts are these. You know, um, you gotta make a ton of them. They look like this until after you iron it. And then after you iron it, it um, gives that nice, sleek, sort of looks like, you know, like that when you're done. Um, you want to have a whole bunch of them, so like finish the tip of his tail. I'm doing Draco Wolf's tail right now. Um, I have a whole handful of fluffs. Um, with a good sized base, like this one, um, I've got about six of the fluffs sewn on it. Now, see, the thing is, is, like she said on her video, you want to actually sew it. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> I have a cold. I was just kicking my hind end. So, anywho, um, that's what you want to do for now. Um, that's the update I have. I am working on it very slowly, um, with the cold, and then I've got kids. I've got other things going on, so I, it's, usually it takes, she said, about 34 to 40 hours for a good tail. I don't have that time to just sit and work on a tail. I can't do it. Not with kids and the Let's Plays and the, um, other things I'm running in Second Life, trying to get a store up and running, things of that nature, so. Anywho, that's the update. Um, i trying to think it's kind of a yarn tail update vlog slash thing um other than having the cold we're doing fine um uh we're not really sure how to do draco wolf's youtube thing just yet because i'm the one that's got the camera um he wants to do things of skyrim so he might eventually um go ahead and use my channel or um the camera and whatnot for his so keep an eye out for him you can find him um under my subscriptions uh Please go ahead and, you know, let's encourage him by giving him a couple of subscribers, if at all possible. But, um, past that, the kittens are fine. They're huge. Um, this little one here is my attacker. She loves me at night. But other than being sick and having a cold, there's really not much else to say. Um, I will say I am up to 937 views last I looked, so thank you for that. Um, I do still have 12 subscribers, which is fine. I love the fact that I even have them. So, if you're one of my 12, thank you very much. All I ask is please like and share, if at all possible.
So if you're seeing this, you know, again, please like and share the vids when you see them. And hopefully I'll be doing some more. I am going to be doing some kid-related ones uh, for people who have children. Um, considering, you know, I have kids. <laughs> so, anywho, um, hopefully we'll see you. And this is Airy Kitten, Crescent Moon, shining out. Bye.